Hello guys, welcome to Jigyasa of Science. Today we are going to discuss 25 important objective type questions and answers for the subject transmission and distributions. These questions are very important for SSC J, Call India 2020, RRB J, ALP, etc. in examinations. So without skipping, watch the video till the end. And before starting, those who are new on the channel, please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon. Let's start the first question. For purely domestic loads, which type of distribution is employed? Option A, single phase two wire. Option B, three phase three wire. C, three phase four wire. D, none of these. The correct answer is single phase two wire. Next question. Which type of load use three phase four wire AC system for distribution? Option A balance, option B unbalanced, C both A and B, D none of these. And the correct answer is unbalanced. Next question In a balanced three phase four wire AC system, the phase sequence is R Y B. If the voltage of R R phase equal to 230 less than 0 degree volts then what will be the B phase and the options are 230 less than 120 degree B 230 less than 90 degree 230 less than 90 degree and 230 less than 120 degree and the correct answer is 230 less than 120 degree next question what are ground detectors Option A used for detecting art faults for all cables. Option B used for detecting ground faults for underground cables. C used for detecting all type of fault in an underground cable. D none of this. And the correct answer is used for detecting ground faults for underground cables. Next question. An industrial consumer has a load pattern of 2000 kilowatt, 0 0.8 leg for 12 hours and 1000 kilowatt UPF for 12 hours. What is its load factor? Option A 10.5, B 0.75, C 0.6, D 2.0. And the correct answer is 0 0.75. Next question. The generating voltage and frequency in India is about option A 11 kVN 60 Hz, B 11 kVN 50 Hz, C 220 kVN 60 Hz, D 220 kVN 50 Hz. And the correct answer is 11 kVN 50 Hz. Next question Which type of system is generally adopted for the generation of transmission of electrical power? Option A 3 phase 4 wire, B 2 phase 3 wire, C 3 phase 3 wire, D none of these. And the correct answer is 3 phase 3 wire. Next question The rated voltage of a 3 phase power system is given by A RMS peak voltage, B peak phase voltage, C RMS line to line voltage, D peak line to line voltage. And the correct answer is RMS line to line voltage. Next question, which of these systems uses the three phase four wire system? Option A, primary distribution, B, secondary distribution, C, primary transmission, D, secondary transmission. And the correct answer is secondary distribution. Next question, with the same maximum voltage to earth, which among the following AC systems with 0.8 power factor will need more copper compared to two wire system. Options are A single phase two wire, B single phase three wire, C three phase three wire, D three phase four wire. And the correct answer is three phase four wire. Next question. Transmission system the weight of copper used is proportional to A square of voltage, B voltage, C 1 by square of voltage D 1 by voltage and the correct answer is square of voltage next question 
greater the power factor the less is the volume of copper required options are a greater b smaller c both are equal d depending on the level of transmission and the correct answer is smaller next question line efficiency increases for less transmission voltages a higher b lower c both a and b d none of this and the correct answer is higher next question the most important disadvantage of using the high voltage for transmission is option a the increased cost of insulating and conductors b the increased cost of transformers switch gear and the other terminal apparatus b both a and b d there is a reduction in the corona loss and the correct answer is both a and b next question the most suitable practical value of primary distribution is a 66 kv b 6.6 kv c 230 volt by 400 volt d 2 kv the correct answer is 6.6 kv next question what is the main drawback of overhead system over underground system option a source problem b high initial cost c higher surging current d underground system is more flexible than overhead system and the correct answer is source problem next question for the same conductor length same amount of power same losses and maximum voltage to earth which system requires minimum conductor area option a 3 wire ac b 2 wire ac c 2 wire dc d single phase and the correct answer is 3 wire ac next question what is the highest possible transmission voltage in india option a 675 kv b 765 kv c 132 kv d 440 kv and the correct answer is 765 kv next question what is the main reason for using the high voltage for the long distance power transmission options are a reduction in the transmission losses b reduction in the time of transmission c increase in system reliability d none of this and the correct answer is reduction in the transmission losses next question the volume of copper required in case of three wire two phase ac system is how many times to that of two wire dc system option a 2 by cos 2 phi option b 1 by 2 cos 2 phi c 1.457 by cos 2 phi d 6 by 1.457 cos 2 phi and the correct answer is 1.457 by cos 2 phi next question the volume of copper required in case of 4 wire 2 phase ac system is how many times to that of 2 wire dc system option are 2 by cos 2 phi b 1 by 2 cos 2 phi c 1.457 by cos 2 phi d 6 by 1.457 cos 2 phi and the correct answer is 1 by 2 cos 2 phi next question by increasing the transmission voltage double of its original value the same power can be dispatched keeping the line losses option a equal to its original value b half of its original value c double of original value d one fourth of the original value and the correct answer is one fourth of the original value next question which among these is the fundamental economical principle which influences the design of transmission lines? Option A, economic choice of conductor size, B, economic choice of transmission voltage, C, both A and B, D, economic choice of transmission line length. The correct answer is both A and B. Next question. The most economical area of conductor is that for which the total annual cost of transmission line is minimum which law states this option a lens law b calvin's law c faraday's law d ohm's law and the correct answer is calvin's law next question the account of interest and depreciation 
on the capital cost of complete installation of transmission line is denoted by which factor option a annual charge on capital outlay b annual cost of energy wasted c both a and b d neither of these and the correct answer is annual charge on capital outlay so thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel and share the video with your friends if you have, you have if you have any queries please let me know in the comment section see you till the next time jai hind jai bharat bye